my name is Tracy King and I'm from right here in Columbus, Ohio, born and raised. And my name is Andrea Haynes and I am locally from Newark, Ohio. Um, for me, when I decided to go to college, I didn't go to school until I was 25 years old. Um, and it was between nursing, teaching, and social work. And I thought social work would be very depressing. And um, I loved kids, so I ended up going with teaching. Um, and I enjoyed it every, every day I did it. Um, but nursing kept calling. And once the children were a little bit older, I decided to go um, where my heart was. And I haven't regretted it. Um, I feel that my drive for nursing is the passion for people. I originally started my first career with chemistry, which I love science, and I love that deep, deep seeking for knowledge, but I miss that people connection. Nursing gives me that opportunity to help someone on a day-to-day -day basis to give you that satisfaction in life. I'm loving every minute of it. I chose Mount Carmel because of the 13-month program and because of their stellar reputation. Just like Tracy, I enjoyed the fast-paced program, but their um, actual very high passing rate on the NCLEX was another big deciding factor for me to be successful in this career. Um, so I taught for 12 years, and for the last few years, I was thinking of changing. It was kind of methodical for me, which was a little of the opposite for Andrea. I had children, and I had to think this out. Um, so I stopped teaching in December of 08. I took all my prerequisites um, in 2009 through Columbus State and then started the program in January of 2010. And mine was a little different from Tracy. I was a little unconventional. I had recently gotten engaged to my now husband and I was living in St. Louis working as a chemist. I founded a uh, biochemical company working as a, as a lab rat, as you could say enjoyed it but knew that the long distance was going to be a problem with getting married so prayed about it really knew that god wanted me in a in a job that was dealing with people and oriented so literally within two weeks got my application in for this program got the ball rolling within four months i took all the prereqs working full time getting everything in and finally was able to start the program in january so it was a very quick turnaround but glad that i did it I think the best part, and you probably agree with this, has been the friendships that we've made. We kind of feel like war buddies. We've, we've gone through something that nobody else has experienced or can understand except for us. And I think each class probably has their own experience, so it's very you know individualized. And um, it's definitely just the camaraderie. People have come from all over. There's people from Miami, Seattle, California. Um, I just feel like I've made lifelong friends, but I couldn't have gotten through this without. And I completely agree with Tracy. That's the best part of being in this group of 70 people. We're in it through thick and thin. It's very intense, late hours, wee mornings, working on homework, but you push each other and that's what collaboration and teamwork is all about, especially in the nursing career. It's all about teamwork, working with physicians, working with nurses, working with aides. We're starting that foundation now as students here in this program and I think that's going to further our career. I think the biggest piece of advice that I can offer any female or anyone that's wanting to seek a different career or start a different chapter in your life is to follow your heart and follow your dreams. I know it was a hard challenge for myself, but I'm thankful every day that I've done it. There will be obstacles along the way. It's not easy, as both Tracy and I can say, but follow your dreams. Life is a world of opportunity. Don't ever give up. It's achievable. And I think I would add to that that there's never going to be a perfect time to make such a huge change. You have to do your work, um, prepare, do the best you can, and just take that leap. 